Hey guys, and welcome to this. Got a Princess Adda deck guide for you today, and we'll play a couple of games. Now, as with uh, the vast majority of Adda lists, this plays around getting a huge combo with Hubert Reg K. Um, now, everything else, well, not everything, but most of the other big boys in the deck is to help line up damage to uh, make this guy as big as possible. So, ideally, you do want last say. Um, but, let's see how we go. Hubert Wrecked is astounding, if you can pull it off. Um, so, we got we got the big boys to line up damage. I'm talking your Sysanthesis Blaze, your Ockfist, your Seltkirk of Gullet. We've got Tainted Ale here to also line up... Uh, some damage and summoning circle to bring out it's really matchup dependent um, you can use it even in round one and pull out some of your weaker stuff get them out of your deck um, now people usually play artifact removal so it may get removed but that just means your tainted ale has a better chance of sticking around or vice versa uh, we got Neneki which is just um, yeah pretty good can help protect some of your stuff or bait removal Vez for damage and to give one of your guys zeal, which can be handy. Uh, Margarita for a lock. Uh, Botchling, which is just a great engine if it's not removed. We got Eek, Eek, Ike for tall removal. And we do have two dragons in the deck in Ockfist and Sysanthesis Blaze. So if you got one of them in your hand, he gets zeal as well. Got Vincent Mice, which uh, yeah can get you some pretty good value. However, keep in mind um, your bit, uh, combo. Um, we got Sabrina, which obviously uh, lines up a lot of damage at the end for you. Uh, two Blue Stripes Commando for thinning, paired with two Blue Stripes Scouts for extra tempo. Uh, two Lyrian Arbalists, which are a good engine if left um, alone, but can bait removal. Two Centurion Artificers for shields to protect, I don't know, one of your other engines perhaps, or even to put onto Seltkirk of Gullet, because when you duel with a shield, oh, sky's the limit. Uh, two Centurion Knights, which can get up to six value for four provisions, and two Damn Sorceresses, which, eh, eh, it's eight. Um, yeah, so uh, that's the deck. Let's gwent it up! Spirit. For my pleasure alone. With an almost opposite ability to our own Adder. So, got to be careful not to be uh, too overpowered here. So, let's get rid of Centurion Knight. Get rid of the other Centurion Knight. And we don't want to draw into the other commando, but if we do, that's okay. Uh, I think we'll get rid of the Artificer here. So, let's open with Arbalist, I feel. Give me a and um, our Vincent Mice should get pretty good value if he's playing big boys, spear tips and such. Hi pal, I hope I'm saying that right. Welcome aboard my friend. Um, I think we'll get the other Arbalist out here. One. And then we'll take out this Drowner. And... Do I want to boost this? don't usually like using tactical advantage to this early, but... Yeah, I think we will. It's a good little engine to protect. <coughs> Ragnar Root. Wow. Don't see that too often. Um, I got no way to deal with that. Unfortunately. But. Let's get Nanaki online. We've already seen one Drowner. 
Hopefully, uh, Fon Goblin over there doesn't help the other. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Go. Go away. Go away. Good, good, good. Alright. Although, if he is playing Ragnarug, he's probably got a few movement cards. Maybe. Definitely unusual. Okay. Fortunately, that kills our Arbalist. But that's alright. So. I think we'll play the Commando here. Gives another charge nice to our Arbalist so we can take out that Wyvern. up our commando. Boost him up to the magic seven. threatening. We could take that out with Vez, but I think that's pretty unnecessary. Let's put out the scout. Well, unfortunately, does have to go on the melee row. Semper Look at that tempo. So, we're doing pretty well now. I am going to want to keep going, because we want this round for two reasons. We want last say, and... We, if we lose round one, we're at great risk of being bled by Woodland round two. So, we will keep going. This is a strange deck this guy's running. Um, I mean, all our stuff here is good. Uh, we could take out, yeah, I think we will. We'll take that out with Vez. Deny that vitality action. He hasn't played anything really good yet so far except Ragnarug. There's the pass. <laughs> I'm a man of culture. Thank you, pal. You too, buddy. Alright, so we will be dry passing into the long round, so we'll get rid of Citrian Knight and Sorceress. Take the dry pass. So we've got Hubert, we've got Sabrina, we've got our two dragons. What would really be good is Ike, especially against Woodland. This is a strange deck this guy's playing here, so could be in for all sorts of things. Link's good. That's uh, pretty good. An artificer is good, but tainted ale or summoning circle would be great. So I'll get rid of Cinturian Knight and the Sorceress. Okay, there's Ike. So no artifacts. So at least if he is playing uh, Mithril, that won't get him any value. if this is like that janky low unit deck where a lot of the stuff is immune. Well, we shall see. I think we'll open with... Put Botchling out. Uh, it would then be vulnerable to Parasite, which is probably running. I'll open with Artificer here. You could always just protect your botchling with a shield. Okay, okay. Uh, is it worth protecting the botchling with a shield? That is the question of our times. I don't think so. 
shield is probably best. Although this early in the round, the Boshling could get us a ton of value. But the shield does go really well onto Selkirk, or it could protect one of our dragons. Yeah, look, let's give the shield to Boshling. Unfortunately, it does mean we can't transform into a Lubbockin. I mean, we could, but we lose the shield. But I think it is worth protecting. Um, unfortunately, it's going to be hitting the tall unit there. Is it worth using Ike here? I think it probably is. I'm sure there's going to be taller units. I fear not for but our botchling is just going to be uh, pushing those down. So, and if there's another tall unit, that just uh, that's just a good target for our adder. Okay, that's all right. So nothing worth locking. Uh, Vincent, I probably want to save for a big boy. But is it even worth doing that? I mean, because any big unit, our adder can just hit. Um, I don't want to play Sabrina this early. I think we'll play Margarita. Just have it on the board and uh, we can always use those charges when the need arises. rid of our Botchling's shield, so I think we will transform into a Lubbockin in that case. And the Werecat is probably worth locking. It's probably not a lot of other stuff against monsters that's worth locking. So... We'll put down Vincent. Cast and I'm not going to use it. If he kills it, it, he kills it. But we're not getting a ton of value from him at this point anyway. And he will be getting boosted by Lubbockin. Bit of protection. He is Rolock to melee though. That's alright, because that means you can't do that to our Silkirk. So... I think we will put down the Silkirk here. Stand and fight, cowards! lining up that back row for us, which is very good for our Sabrina. Let's play some cards, Von Goblin. Okay. No worries, no worries. We've still got our two big dragons. Now, our most valuable dragon is probably Sosenthesis Blaze, even though Ockfist will hit more targets and get more damage on its face. I think Sosenthesis Blaze is worth saving just in case he somehow boosts up Sabrina. So we can do multiple damage to Sabrina with Sosenthesis. Sosenthesis. So let's play the Ockfist. 
vulnerable to Parasite, if he's still got it. But uh, our Lubbockin is doing the Lord's work in this match. He's really uh, getting a lot of value for us. Yeah, there's Parasite. No worries. So... I think ultimately it's more important we have the synthesis blaze, so let's put down Sabrina. See what he can do. So we'll flip this back to a botchling. Get back that one point. Put down to synthesis blares. Let's see what we got here. Okay. I think we got it guys. Uh, so I'll use Adder first. Best bet is against Weavis. Okay, let's hit Sabrina. Hopefully we don't get a forfeit here. Let me have my fun please, sir. Yeah, we'll switch this back to a Lubbockin for a bit of fun. Uh, we did it! We did it! Alright, that was good. Let's jump into another. I uh, Thneet. There will be no uh, negotiation. It's probably not a good matchup for us. There's a lot of control, a lot of tempo. We shall see. Alright, we got both blue striped scouts, but no commando. So Get rid of Artificer. And um, I'll get rid of one of the scouts. Not a great hand. Swords I smile at, weapons okay. love to score. If only we had Ike, we could take care of that immediately. But that's alright. Let's put down the Arbalists. Fade out that removal. I'm a be playing Ida. So they will have some yeah, artifacts yeah. removal. Kisparin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not great. Oh, I think let's just dump some of our garbage here. So it's unlikely we're going to have last say. Nithany sometimes does play tall removal, like Geralt Professional, because they can line it up with pings. Go away. Peace with humans? I buy that. take an early pass here. It's not great. We might get punished, but we're gonna have just gonna have to try and keep up. Come on man. 
got some trash. Go to sorceress. And the other sorceress. Okay. So Naneke is row locked, but could help protect our commandos. Okay, is he just dumping rubbish? That's the question of our times. What do I want to commit? Let's put down the artificer. Let's make something, something beautiful together. Okay. So we're not going to get bled. The question is, do I try to thin out my commandos now, or do I try to keep them for the good tempo? Watching the woods grow. Shut up. Yeah, look, I'm gonna I'm gonna send them. Send her I know it's giving up a lot of tempo, but that's just a lot of control in Ithney. And it means we don't have to worry about this trash in the deck. Death to the so the only trash left in our deck is the other uh, <laughs> Blue Stripes Scout. Bears is good. Hike is good, potentially. So I'll get rid of the Sorceress. Alright, we got both our artifacts. One will be removed. I think, what else could we want? Ah, oh, yeah. Got some other good stuff, Synthesis Blaze, Margarita, but one, two, three, four, are worse than anything in my hand. Yeah, I think we'll, we'll keep this. So, let's open with the Summoning Circle. I'm sure it will be removed, but that should help keep our... Tainted ale safe, perhaps. Just play these out. Not give him anything to interact with, and he's doing the same. Um, that's alright, we could put down Botchling here, or Nanaki. I think we'll go with Nanaki here. Another question is if our summoning circle does survive, what we might want to pull out with that. So, Blaze is 11, no chance. Mother is 8, maybe. Vincent, 6. The artifice of the Okay, never mind. Never mind. Okay. So, he is playing into the melee row, which works out for us. Uh, let's go with... We'll go with Vez. No. I might save Vez for if there's something actually worth removing. Let's put out the Botchling. And I'm going to protect it by one. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. That's fine. If he's got Malane or something, he can just ping it once with an Ithony charge. Or lock it. Okay. That's alright. I think we will go with... Let's go with Vez here. I'm interested. And we'll boost it up. Boost it. Yeah, let's use all the charges. Boost them while you got them. Okay. 
So we could give zeal to, I guess, our Seltkirk. I think it's probably worth doing. Because if we try to keep our Seltkirk on the board, it's just going to get taken So we may as well use it now. Not too far ahead. And those two big immune units we can't do anything with. And our Sabrina. He could just ping with his own charge, which isn't great news, but uh, that's alright. Okay, what's the order of things here? Ike, I don't know if Ike's going to get value. Hockfist will, I think. Obviously Hubert will be last, and I think we'll do Sabrina, either Sabrina or Ockfist second last. So I think let's put down the Ike. If it's removed, it's removed. God bless it. My breastplate chafes. I think we will put down Sabrina next. Still got all his ice knee charges. And we don't have a great target for Adder either at this point. Ah, oh, okay. Interesting. So we could just destroy that straight up. You fight I well. think we will. Because he can just too easily take care of this. I'm surprised he didn't with Ithne charges anyway. So, let's put down Sabrina. Battles are won or lost by the commanders, not by take sorceresses. Care of old Gregoire over there. So we're still a bit behind. Well, we'll see. In hindsight, that may have been an error. Because if we could have got rid of the shield from Gregoire with Ockfist. That would have been our best target for Adder, but we'll see. This might all be for naught, even if we pull off a great Hubert. He's probably got tall removal anyway. So, let's put down Ockfist. Hope it survives. Play our Ale on Sabrina. Okay, he's taking care of Ockfist. Shiro, jeez. Okay, you don't see that very often. Um, okay. Let's see what we get. So if he's got tall removal, 
We did it! Wow. Very good. Pretty convincingly. 29 to 13, guys. So, uh, yeah, that's two for two. I think we'll leave it there for today. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Um, try out the deck. Let me know what you think. Hit a like. Hit a subscribe. Leave a comment. Why not? And uh, until next time. See you later.